sing a song about smoking flames The fire down our lazy yesterdays Hey, hey, what's up? My name is Brendan Kelly. I play in the Lawrence Arms and Falcon and you're watching Raw Cut Media. How do you feel knowing that Armageddon may or may not actually hit us tonight? Well, I'm, I'm happy to be here for one thing and like, like I said on stage, the thing that people constantly uh, misunderstand about the rapture is it does not mean that the world will end. It just means that all the righteous will get carried up to heaven. And um, that sounds awesome to me because those people have been bugging me for like pretty much my whole life. So I, the rapture sounds like it's going to be win-win for pretty much everybody. So uh, bring it on. I think the kids are saying bring it on still. Yeah. So basically what you're saying is all the people left down here are just the ones who... Yeah, the, 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 the dirt bags and stuff like that. I mean, I, I will be left down here and all the people I hang out with will be left down here. So that's that's cool. Pretty sure everyone who's taking a breath of air. Will be yeah, yeah, here, more so. or less. Whoa, this guy's wearing all denim. It's cool. Anyway. You'll see all sorts of characters around here. Have you been people watching? Oh, yeah, I mean, like, Montreal's got one of the most unique uh, fashion senses of any place I've ever been. And um, it's truly inspiring in, uh, in, all, in all directions, I gotta say. Truly inspiring in a good way or in a I'm uh, never ever going to do that way? In all directions. <laughs> So you've taken to blogging recently? I've oh, it's been it. like it's been like two years. I've been doing it kind of almost every day. Okay. Um, yeah, I, there's like 500 pages of that thing now. What motivates you to blog? Is it just I feel like writing anything that comes to mind? Or? Well, I've got I've got a couple of kids now, and um, my time is not what it once was, and. Uh, I have like a sort of obsessive compulsive need to create and kind of get feedback on that creation and that's what like motivated me to be in a band in the first place and uh, you know for better or for worse I just don't have the time to like sit down and write songs. If, like, if my kids are awake I can't be playing music and if my kids are asleep I definitely can't be playing music because it'll wake them up. I don't live in a huge house or anything so uh, blogging is like my little way of like keeping myself Keep my brain alive, I guess, you know. So when you do have find the time to write songs, do you ever write songs thinking this would be a good Lawrence song, or is it? I, I write I write songs and then kind of determine what the uh, where they would go uh, once once they're done. It's kind of hard to have too much. Writing songs is kind of like barfing. It just kind of happens, and it's it's just like a big expulsive process. And when it's done kind of look at the results and you can kind of determine what's going on at that point, you know. So you're frequently analyzing after you throw up? No, I, I don't barf that much. I'm, I'm uh, pretty good. My gag reflex is pretty strong and, you know, but, yeah, I'm, I'm not much, I'm not much for, like, uh, going through um, any sort of expulsions or defecations, really, no. Uh, I, I, you know, honestly, I have no idea. Um, whoa. That dude's wearing shoulder pads. Cool shoulder pads. <laughs> cool town. I love it. It's awesome. Uh, what's in the future for me? I don't know, man. I'm not trying to figure it all out today, you know. I'm just like, uh, going one day at a time, paint one arm white, one arm black, get some shoulder pads, and just kind of rule. A little bit, maybe some goggles. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, no, I don't know, man. Uh, I'm trying to put out a record this year. That's that's like the big thing musically that I'm pushing towards. 